Hey, you, you're not here by accident. You press play for a reason. Your soul knows what you need. This meaning is divine between me and you. And I'm going to tell you right now, your life will change if you stop doing these four things and you start doing the four things that I'm about to talk about. For so long in our life, we are choosing the wrong things and we're expecting right things to happen. I want you to imagine just for a moment, just for a moment, how would your life change if you stopped choosing the wrong things? Because listen, it's a choice. I know sometimes it feels forced. I know sometimes it feels like you have no choice, but at the end of the day, it is a choice. We're choosing the wrong things. We're choosing the wrong people. And I know it's easier said than done, but it is a choice. We're choosing the wrong friends. We're choosing the wrong environment and we want the right things to happen. Nothing is going to change if you don't make this change. So how would your life be different if you start choosing the right things? How would your life grow if you let go of the wrong things in your life? So I want to challenge you right now. Number one, start choosing peace before you date, before you create, before you start your day. I want you to start choosing peace. How would your life be different if you start choosing peace and you stop choosing people over your peace? How would your life be different if you start choosing peace and you stop choosing pain? Over your peace. How would your life be different if you start choosing peace and you stop choosing excuses over your peace? How would your life be different if you made peace the foundation for your life? How would your life be different if you prioritized your peace and everything else became secondary? Hey, you, I'm sorry to interrupt you really quick. I see you're still watching this, so you must be enjoying this. I have plenty of content just like this. So subscribe, hit the like button, and also leave a comment. And please, if it's on your heart, share it. Thank you. How would today be different for you? Because let's be real. A lot of us every single day, we choose the wrong things. We choose the wrong people. We choose people's opinions instead of our peace. We choose people's drama and gossip instead of our peace. We choose other people's pain, even our own, instead of our peace. And we are literally allowing these things to guide our life and we wonder why our soul is troubled. We wonder why we're exhausted. We wonder why we're burnt out because you're allowing the wrong things to control the pace of your life. You see, I believe each and every one of us, we have a pace that we're meant to run. And what happens when we start choosing the wrong things instead of our peace? Hmm. We run the pace of those problems. We run the pace of those toxic people. We run the pace of our past pain. And we wonder why we're exhausted. We wonder why we're burnt out. We wonder why we're behind. Because we're not running the pace that's true to us. Peace is your pace. So right now in this moment, as you're hearing my voice, watching me, hearing me, I want you to choose peace. Choose peace above everything. Choose peace as your power. And when you choose peace, it will transform your life. And let's be clear, peace doesn't mean when you choose your peace, it doesn't mean everything's going to go right. It doesn't mean everybody's going to like you. It doesn't mean you won't have chaos around you. It doesn't mean you won't have storms. What it means is that storms won't have you. What it means is those opinions won't penetrate your mindset and become your truth. What it means is that those people that will try to make you feel guilty for choosing your peace, you might hear them, but they won't bother you because you're operating in peace. The second thing I want to challenge you with is how would your life be different if you decided right now in this moment to say, I'm going to choose joy today. I'm going to choose joy. I'm going to smile no matter what it looks like. I'm going to make my perspective my power no matter what it looks like. When it rains, I'm going to find reason to dance in the rain. When it storms in my life, I'm going to find reasons to be thankful in the storms. 
When things aren't going great, I'm still going to find reasons to be grateful because right now in this moment, I am deciding to choose joy. I'm allowing joy to be the operating system of my soul. I'm no longer choosing stress. I'm no longer choosing worry. I'm no longer choosing fear. I'm no longer choosing anxiety. Do you feel me? We didn't chose that for far too long. And we're expecting a better life with those things leading our life. Not anymore. In this moment right now, you are choosing joy. You might be thinking, Trent, why should I choose joy? Why not? Right? Why choose stress when joy is available? Why choose negativity when positivity is available? Why choose fear when faith is available? Choosing joy doesn't mean that you won't have sad moments. You won't have depressed moments. It means that those moments won't have you. It means that those moments won't become you. It means that your mood won't become your character. It means that I know that these things are going to pass through because I'm choosing joy despite. Despite my setback, I'm choosing joy. Despite your challenges, you're choosing joy. Despite your circumstances, you're choosing joy because joy is that fuel that progresses your soul forward the third thing i want you to choose is i want you to choose you i want you to be a little bit selfish in a positive way we're so good at choosing other people we're so good at giving our energy to other people we're so good at putting other people first. We're so good at prioritizing everybody else. And we wonder why mentally we're drained. We wonder why spiritually we're de depleted. We wonder why we feel defeated. We wonder why emotionally we're exhausted. Because we're putting everybody first. I just want to ask you this question. How would your life be different right now, today in this moment? If you start giving yourself some of those same things that you give everybody else. If you start giving yourself those same compliments that you give everybody else. If you start giving yourself that same grace that you always give everybody else. What if you decide to redirect your energy towards you for once and stop expending so much energy on everybody else? I'm not telling you to be selfish. I'm not telling you to be self-centered. I'm not telling you to change your heart because I love a giver. But I want you to be reminded of this. You got to remember. You got to give to yourself too. You know, nobody can pour from an empty cup. You got to do the things that fill your cup up. So I don't know what choosing you looks like. But maybe it's getting back to having fun in your life. Maybe it's getting back to your dreams. Maybe it's deciding to step away from certain situations, from certain environments. Maybe it's putting your soul on D&D, &D, do not disturb, just like you do your phone. Maybe it's saying, you know what, this weekend is for me. I'm going to do something for me today. Maybe it's pamping yourself, whatever it may mean to you. But it's time for you to choose you. I'm not telling you to stop choosing other people. But I am telling you to stop choosing the wrong people. I am telling you to stop choosing the wrong energy. Because some of us, when we don't choose ourselves, I've been guilty of this. We're giving so much of our good energy away. We're using so much of our energy as if energy is an infinite source that, that we're always going to have. And wonder why we're exhausted because we're giving so much of it away that we don't have the energy to put back into our own life, to put back into our own dreams. To put back in the things that we care about, the things that we want to do, because we're so drained. 
You got to protect your energy. And stop giving away as if it's priceless. Stop spending your energy trying to prove yourself to people who will never understand you. 